If by chance you manage to find a wallet, like this wallet here, filled with bitcoins, the first thing you will need to do is convert the private key you found into the Wi-Fi format so that you can import this wallet into Electron and retrieve your bitcoins. I will provide you for free in the description a link to a code that converts any Bitcoin private key into the Wi-Fi format, which means wallet import format. It's the format you need to be able to import your wallet into Electron. I will show you how the code works and how you can run it on your computer. So go ahead and leave a like so we can fight against the forces of evil. For those subscribed to the channel, my dear friends, you already know this, but for those who are just dropping in, we have these challenges here offering millions of bitcoins. These are brute force challenges where you need to discover the private key. And the private key, once you discover it, gives you access to the bitcoins. For example, in this one, it is offering 6.7 bitcoins to whoever finds the private key. Private keys are a bunch of little numbers. That's exactly what you understood. It's a treasure hunt. From the moment you find the little numbers, you automatically win. 6.7 bitcoins. If we look here at an example of one that was found, this one was found in September of last year. It was the most recent one that paid 6.6 .6 bitcoins. Its private key has already been revealed. Do you see these numbers here? Do you see 32? These are the secret numbers. Anyone who knew this number until September could claim the 6.6 .6 bitcoins. The first one who found it claimed it. After that, yeah, it was over. So now people are searching for the next numbers. Let's open this one here, for example, just to take a look. It has several formats here. This is the format of the private key. And here we have the Wi-Fi format, which is the format we use to import into Electron. To import into Electron, I've made several videos here on the channel, but it's easy. You go to File, click on a new wallet, and then you select Import Bitcoin from a private key. But here it doesn't accept the private key. In this 2832 format, it accepts in the IF format, which is this format here, 5HP. Blah, 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 blah. If we copy this format, we can click Next and import the wallet. The wallet will be imported here. It no longer has a balance because all the bitcoins were already redeemed before showing the code. I want to show you that the IF calculation is very simple. It is a completely different format. So small mathematical calculations to get there. It's as follows. Let's take the IF here, which is the 5 HP. Ba ba ba. Finishes. At my place, and let's put it here in the crypto calculator. Here in the crypto calculator, we have a bunch of buttons that perform a lot of functions. It's very useful site. Obviously. It's not compromised, okay, I've already checked, but still, don't use your private key on sites, okay? This here is just a public private key. Everyone already knows it. That's why I'm using it to teach you, but don't use it because there's a high risk with the site. It's compromised and you could lose your Bitcoins, as has happened to many people. With that warning given, I'm gonna do the following. I'm going to take the IF and perform the base 58 decode. I will decode the base 58. And look how interesting. From the moment I click here, it will give me the private key exactly, with an addition of eight characters and another 80 here at the beginning that he put. So that's all you need to do to do the reverse, to calculate the private key for the Eve. You start with the private key, copy it, paste it here in the crypto calculator and add 80 at the beginning, okay? This is in the IP specification, add 80 because you are on the mainnet in the production environment. And then you will double click X256, just like in the Bitcoin address calculation. And remember those eight characters we saw? They are here. These are the first eight here. Got it? So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You will copy these characters. Add the private key again at the beginning, not forgetting the 80. And now, if we do the opposite, if we do base 58 encode, we will get to our IF5HP ending in Gaza. Wow, master, thank you. This knowledge is very valuable, especially the part about the website. And you're right, you don't want to use the website. You want to use a script that you run offline without internet. So the script is here. It is very simple. It has some JavaScript libraries. The base 58, as I showed you, is part of the code. You will simply put your key here without adding 80, without checksum or anything. The pure key that you found, you used all your luck. You found a challenge. You have the key. You put it here. You will open the terminal and run the command. Node, the FGS, it will run for you. Shall we test with that key we just tested? I will copy it here again, paste it here in place of the key I was testing, not forgetting to save. Let's clear the screen to make it easier to see. And I will run the command again. No doubt Wi-Fi JS. And now it generated here. Hadi. Sikex Trinse. Yeso. This is the address of Wallet 66. And the Wi-Fi was different. And the Wi-Fi was different. 
Why? Because here I am generating the compressed Wi-Fi. See? This one is the uncompressed. It's the decompressed. The difference between the compressed and the compressed, I'll be honest, I don't know. I haven't studied it yet, but I will study it to make a new video and bring this knowledge to you because knowledge is never too much. Knowledge, no one can take it away from you. So if you liked it, leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed and see you next time.